The European Union has renewed sanctions on Monday against the ruling coalition's candidate for the president in Democratic Republic of Congo, Emmanuel Ramazani Shadari, as well as 13 other senior officials. The decision is likely to worsen relations between the EU and President Joseph Kabila's government, which has lobbied against sanctions it calls an illegal violation of its sovereignty. Kabila has also refused to accredit EU election observers, despite concerns by opposition politicians, civil society activists, and foreign powers about the credibility of the December 23rd vote. Kabila is due to step down after 18 years in power and wants Shadari as his successor. The EU imposed sanctions in 2016 and 2017 on Shadari and 15 other nationals over violent crackdowns on protests and uh, repeated delays to the election, which was originally meant to take place two years ago. Shadari served as interior minister during some of the protests and as a senior official in Kabila's PPRD party.